Cybersecurity is one of the most essential foundations for modern business operations, especially for small companies that often manage sensitive information without the advanced protection systems used by large corporations. Small businesses are increasingly targeted by online threats because they handle valuable customer and financial data but may lack strong defense measures. Understanding cybersecurity helps business owners protect their systems, maintain customer trust, and ensure smooth digital operations. This tutorial will guide you through building strong security practices, following important data protection regulations such as the General Data Protection Regulation and the California Consumer Privacy Act, and applying safe testing techniques to evaluate your business's digital safety. The first step toward achieving strong cybersecurity is understanding what it means in practice. Cybersecurity refers to the protection of computer systems, networks, and data from unauthorized access, misuse, or damage. Every business that uses digital tools from websites and email accounts to cloud services and online payment systems needs to secure these assets. A small business should start by identifying which digital resources are most valuable, such as customer records, business financial data, and employee details. After identifying these key resources, the business can assess what potential risks might threaten them and create strategies to prevent those risks from turning into real problems. Taking preventive measures rather than waiting for a security issue to occur is always the most effective approach. One of the most important actions is setting up strong access control protocols. Each employee should have their own login information, and these credentials should be safeguarded with complex passwords and verification systems that require more than one step to confirm a user's identity. For instance, using both a password and a verification code sent to a mobile device adds an extra layer of protection. Administrative access should only be given to staff members who truly need it, reducing the risk of accidental or intentional misuse. Another effective method is dividing the company's internal network into smaller, controlled sections. This way, if one area experiences a problem, the issue will not spread throughout the entire system. Data protection is at the heart of cybersecurity. All sensitive data should be encrypted, which means it is converted into a form that can only be read by those who have permission. Encryption ensures that even if information is intercepted or accessed without authorization, it remains unreadable and useless to outsiders. In addition to encryption, small businesses should schedule regular data backups. These backups should be stored in secure locations separate from the main operating systems. This practice protects the company from data loss caused by system failures or malicious attacks. Businesses should also establish policies that define how long data will be kept and ensure that old or unnecessary data is securely deleted once it is no longer needed. Complying with data protection regulations is another critical responsibility for small businesses. The General Data Protection Regulation, known as the General Data Protection Regulation, sets detailed rules for how personal data must be handled within the European Union. It requires that companies obtain clear consent before collecting personal information and explain how that information will be used. The California Consumer Privacy Act gives similar rights to residents of California, allowing them to know what data is collected about them and to request its removal if they choose. Small businesses that work with customer information should update their privacy policies, keep transparent records of how data is processed, and ensure they can respond to customer inquiries in compliance with these laws. Observing these regulations not only prevents legal issues, but also builds trust with customers who value transparency and responsibility. Employee awareness is one of the strongest defenses a business can have. Many online security problems occur because of simple mistakes or lack of awareness. Business owners should train their staff to recognize suspicious messages, fake websites, or unsafe attachments that could harm the system. 
Training sessions should also cover safe internet use, such as avoiding sharing business information over unsecured networks and keeping devices updated with the latest software versions. Building a company culture that values security awareness can greatly reduce the risk of data breaches. Using reliable protection tools such as firewalls and antivirus programs is another key step. A firewall acts as a shield that monitors and filters information coming in and out of a network, blocking anything that does not meet security standards. Antivirus and anti-malware programs continuously check computers for harmful files or activity and remove any detected threats. These tools must be updated frequently so they can recognize new types of risks. Some systems also include monitoring tools that track unusual activity and send alerts to the administrator if something suspicious occurs. Businesses should also regularly test their systems to ensure their security measures are working correctly. This can include reviewing system logs, checking for outdated software, and conducting internal assessments to identify areas that might need improvement. The goal is to find weaknesses before they can be exploited by malicious parties. These tests should be performed responsibly and safely, focusing on improvement rather than intrusion. The results can then be used to strengthen the company's protection strategies. Keeping software and hardware up to date is one of the simplest yet most effective ways to maintain cybersecurity. Developers often release updates that fix vulnerabilities or bugs that could be used by attackers. Small businesses should have a clear policy for updates to ensure that all devices and systems, including computers, mobile phones, routers, and cloud applications, are using the most current versions. Automating these updates can save time and ensure consistency across the organization. Finally, it is vital for every small business to have an incident response plan. This plan outlines what steps should be taken if a security issue arises. It should include how to identify the problem, stop it from spreading, recover lost data, and communicate with affected customers if necessary. The plan should assign responsibilities so that everyone knows what to do in a crisis. Being prepared helps the business recover faster and maintain its reputation even in difficult situations. In conclusion, cybersecurity for small businesses is not just about technology, it is about responsibility, awareness, and consistent protection. By following strong security practices, complying with privacy laws, training employees, maintaining updated systems, and regularly testing their defenses, small businesses can create a secure digital environment. This commitment to security not only protects valuable information, but also builds customer confidence and ensures long-term success in the digital marketplace.